Plants are usually known by their genus name. Genus is cordyline and uh, this plant belongs to the family Asparagaceae. The new leaves that you can see those are bright pink colored and as they mature the leaves turn into deep brown or deep maroon you can say. There are some variegations in the leaf and this is a very easy growing house plant. This plant loves a lot of shade. You will not place this plant under sunlight but the plant requires a lot of bright light. I have grown three pots of cordyline and they are not very old. Uh, one of the pot was kept under sunlight and the leaves have dried. This pot has broken and I will not change this pot as the plant is growing so well and showing its foliage. I can even change the pot but as the plant is growing well, I uh, will not change my pot. I will just add some amount of manure as the roots have come out. This is the plant which was kept under sunlight and the leaves have dried. From here I will propagate by cutting off the stems and by making some cuttings. I will place them uh, in a glass of water and after some days will place them in soil. To my viewers and subscribers, I would like to tell you that from now I will share two notes on gardening that will be displayed on the screen and that will help you in gardening. So this is the plant where I have cut out the stem and a new plant has grown by the side. The dried leaves should be always separated. For the cordyline plant, you always use porous soil and uh, you can take normal garden soil mixed with sand and leaf compost and a little amount of fertilizer. From these two stems, I will make four cuttings and will place them in a glass of water. And uh, let's wait and see after few days what happens to the cuttings, whether root forms or not. So we will be back after some days. Wow, amazing roots have grown in the stem. Friends, you can see, so lovely roots have grown within 15 days. I am back here after two weeks and even new shoots have grown in the stem. We can see, so lovely roots have grown and now if we place these cuttings in the soil, uh, the plant will grow. Friends, uh, these are the creations you know in my garden and uh, telling you that uh, this plant I have not bought it from the nursery. Uh, this is a collection in my garden uh, from a friend's house and uh, so let's have a look upon the cordyline plant. Uh, this is the plant and it's showing its foliage the leaves are so beautiful variegated and this is the one of the other pot and this is the pot where i had made the cutting you can see this is the branch and uh, after cutting uh, the stem uh, there will be even a new growth in the stem by the side there will be a growth and uh, after there is growth i will give you the follow-up of this plant so friends, that's all about uh, cordyline plant. It is very easy growing plant. You can grow this plant in your garden and uh, this is the time for propagation. So thanks for watching.